Hey, welcome back everybody. Sign here again with another episode of Ultimate Skyblock. And, wow, well, we a lot of stuff in here still to get rid of. I'll loot all. Blood Moon Trophy, yeah, I don't think I need that. I just had the Steampunker move in and bought a Contaminator, which I might be useful later on. And we got Hello Key Mole Drop. Which is kind of a blast from the past, isn't it? Oh uh, yeah, used for crafting a Hallow Key. And boom. From the mod... Oh, what was it again? Miscellanaria. And it's an alternate way of getting the keys, I guess. So, so there's that. We've got those. Been doing some hard mode fishing. Mainly for, you know, the Crimson Crate, so I can get free Souls of Night. Did I make... I did make a Mithril Anvil, okay. And let's see, I don't think I need to worry too much about the pick. We'll keep that, though. Alright. Dazen, I've got some stuff to sell you. But I'm not actually going to be mining the ores, right? But, you know, fishing fishing's always good. And, yeah, I think you know, I'll sell that off too, I guess. We'll keep everything else. I mean, I should have enough palladium now that I could make a palladium pick, but it's kind of a moot point. But one thing I wanted to do is I wanted to get a Destroyer Summon. It's one of these, but I needed Souls of Night for that. Let's see, it's 4.43. So yeah, we got a bit of time. Well, let's see what else is there to do, really. Uh, I, we could maybe try for an ice cold. It has to be snowing, though. Wyvern doesn't seem like a bad idea. Let's go ahead and head on up. And we have our optic staff, so at least we have, you know, some help. And... here we go. Our wonderful sky fishing area. Yeah, right now I have my auto fisher down at my crimson area. Where's there's not even any harpies around? Seriously? Where's everybody at? Yeah, I was over here. My steampunker moved in next to my guide, so I've got a hello pylon over there now. And when it was just my guide, I was. Hey, look at you. I was having herpes all the time, so. Ten souls of plight. And a wyvern relic. Okay. Well, that can go there. Can I get another one in like a minute? Also, this is all pearlstone now, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Hey, nice. Full souls of flight. That means we might be able to get some wings of some kind going. Uh, accessories. We'll just look up wing, right? Wedling wings and anklet of the wind. I don't have a tattered bat or bee wing. Hmm. Dude, I could have sworn that I would have had one by now. Cause I mean, I've been doing a lot of farming over in the uh, 
the jungle area, but apparently nobody dropped a wing for me. I did buy the jetpack from the steampunker though, so at least we have something resembling, you know, hard mode wings. So do not use V-Nades against the destroyer, because what mainly happens is just a storm of probes comes out. Can we do it again, actually? Oh, missed. Okay. There we go. How many come out that time? Yeah. Oh, oops. Tried fucking on the back of the destroyer. That didn't. Did not end so well. Oh, look, he didn't despawn either. So the Uzi with crystal bullets is only about 500 DPS. I doubt that's going to really be of any help, but you never know. You know something that infinitely pierces? We are getting decent damage in whenever I can hit him with this. Yeah, we're doing like maybe 500 DPS, and this guy's got 153,000 health. So.
funny thing is the B nades were actually doing almost as much damage as the Uzi. I was getting like 400 DPS off of these. Which is kind of funny, but... Get the hell out of here, you stupid... Is that armor? Okay, he's under 10,000 now. Oh, come on, really? 800 damage, or 800 health left. Yeah, 700, or 698 health. Oh, he's coming back, though. I just took him a little bit to uh, turn around a bit. <laughs> there he is. There we go. Get the hell out of here. Alright, more hollow bars. We have Souls of Might. We have a deactivated probe. It's the wonderful Master Mode pet. Titanium bars and cobalt. And the putrid scent. Anything I want right about now. Um, what you even come from, dude? Sunstone, beetle husk, solomite, lizard bricks. Oh, that's kind of cool. You can actually craft one of your own to have it a farm up golem all the time. Uh, let's see, is there anything through Night's Edge that requires all three? But I am looking forward to that. 20 of each as well, okay. Drac or the pickaxe axe. Uh, I'll need this for chlorophytes, yeah. Mega shark is an option. So I need a mini shark, I need illegal gun parts, and shark fin. Oh god, shark fins. Those are fun to get in the normal world. We have three. I do have a shark statue though. Hmm. Should I set up a farm for that? It probably wouldn't be a bad idea to set up a farm. What do I have for statues? A lot of angel statues. Hmm. A dragonfly statue, yeah. I have to slime statue, it looks like. Okay. I'm just thinking about setting up a statue farm. I mean, the Mega Shark sounds like a good idea. And these are all made with banners, okay. Air Corsair, Deckhand, Spike Ball. Oh, that's the rotating Spike Ball, okay, gotcha. Spike Jungle Slime. I'm not going to be worried about that too much. Rones, Trapper, Blazing Wheel, also from the dungeon. Bomb Statue, Chattering Teeth, Flying Dutchman, let's <laughs> not. Giant Tortoise, hmm. Sure, why not? Green Slime, yeah. That's probably good enough for now, I want to say. Talk to uh, Durin here. Hey, you actually sell up to titanium ore. Okay. Seventy-five cop or seventy-five silver a piece.
All right, let's grab our health forge out of here. That in. Make ourselves a titanium forge. And then a bunch of titanium bars. Go ahead and make some armor. Um, go and just stick with the magic. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Alright, so 51 defense now versus 38. So yeah, 13 more points into defense is pretty good. And then set bonus attacking generates a defensive barrier of titanium shards. Okay. Mm, I can work with that. Let's look at magic weapons that we can make. And <laughs> none of them are hard mode. Grab us. That was a lava bucket. Grab the sponge in case I screw up. Um, slab. Right. The hell, man! Why are you down here? Do I have my? Pretty sure I made a grand design, right? Infinite grand design. All right, cool. Right about here is probably as good a spot as any. Here's a question, right? If I put you here and just dump like a bucket of lava, are you going to pop up? No, you're not. Okay, cool. Here we go. Let's go ahead and get our design. I need, though, a timer. A timer or, you know, four. Can I not stack you on top of each other? Oh, well, that's fine. Uh, let's do red wire, right? Also, you know what? Go away. We'll set you to here. We'll do a spot like that. Go ahead and cycle the green then, and we'll do... Actually, we'll do one higher. So, let's go ahead to blue. Then we'll go to yellow, right? Now there's like the things, the crosses wherever they are. I can't remember what they're called or something. Head. 
basically like a signal isolator is what it is. These guys, junction boxes. Separates wire paths. I've never used these before, so I'm just kind of winging it here. So if I was to go, see, you're on yellow right now, okay. Like this, but I'm gonna have to cross over my green wires like that, right? And it's not wanting to place. Let's see, what are we on? A little easier to see what we're doing now. Okay, so what's up with these? Do I just... Do I have to place them on something? Okay, yeah, you do. Gotcha. So that won't quite work. Let's just try it as is and see if I can get the desired effect out of it. Did I leave blue on? I did. That explains why it was looking like it was. It's like, that doesn't look like yellow. to faded. There we go. Be a little bit better now. Including being able to see where I need to place blocks. Alright. I'm going to take a left for the tortoises to die, but I should be able to farm up tortoise sh uh, turtle shells too, this way. Getting gel anyway. Yeah, statues will stop spawning once they reach a certain number of creatures. And a shark stick forever to die too. Well, we are playing. We're not playing classic difficulty, so I mean. Man, they do take forever to die. Traps may have been the better option. Hmm. Good idea now. guessing I need a graveyard biome. Tomb crawler now. What the heck are they called? I think uh, obelisk is one of them. No crafting recipe though, huh? maybe? Nope, and we are on pretty much everything. Hmm. Uh, P-Bones turns, or has an option to turn off grave spawning when you die. 
which is probably just never deal with it. The same mod is also supposed to op or uh, add in a way to obtain them for getting graveyard biomes. So. We don't happen to have like a bunch of graves around here somewhere, do we? It's all crimson. Is there a pre-made graveyard biome? Oh, I need to check that island there out too. I don't think there is. Oh, how are you doing over here anyway? You are basically done. Okay, cool. Hmm. Well then, uh, I probably should do that anyway. All right, I turned it off now so I can make sure this is working correctly. And it looks like it is. I, I just went ahead and put a boulder statue down here, hooked it up to a one second timer. It's, yeah, it takes longer than one second to uh, get over the cooldown. But we have been getting turtle shells, which is kind of nice. No shark fins, though. And here comes that, and yep. <laughs> it punts the sharks out of the, uh... Out of the kill chamber. Hey, we got a shark fin. Nice. Come on, Boulder. Do your thing. Cool. Extra blocks in the way. Keep the sharks from coming flying through the wall at me. I just need one more shark pin to uh, to make them be a mega shark. So. be able to get to the arms dealer from down here without too many hassles. This is really cool. Also, give me that. There's our arms dealer. One thing I love about the jetpack is if you hold up, you just rocket straight up, which is great. Uh, I need, I think I've got a mini shark already, but just in case I don't. All right, and let's crack that open. Ice blade, I've already got one, I think. <laughs> Even the same price, it's kind of cool. So you let me get a bunch of these. And yeah, I might as well grab a bunch of these as well. Yeah, we have four, we need five. Okay. Shouldn't take too much longer. I hope. So I just noticed something interesting. I went AFK for like 10 minutes and uh, come back. I had turtle shells and I had slime stats, but I didn't have any shark fins. 
So I tossed my minions in there and instantly four shark fins. So shark statues apparently don't drop. Okay, that one was off. Okay. Uh, apparently the uh, shark spawn from statues don't drop fins unless the player kills them somehow. Alright, come on. There you go. Alright, and fins. So Mega Shark is a go. And it came out shoddy. Oh well. I'll take Unreal. It does one less damage than the Uzi. Of course the Uzi's just quick, but uh fifty percent chance to save ammo. 290 DPS versus 225. So, and it has much less of a spread, which is even better. Also, we've got a lot of turtle shells now. Yeah, let's go ahead and put that stuff away. But I think I'm going to go ahead and call this an episode. I need to make a mechanical skull next, and I don't have... I think it's the Souls of Light needed. Yeah, I need three Souls of Light. So, more fishing. But thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And until the next one. Signing out. Have fun.